in the Salesforce space, Logic Spree, we do Salesforce implementations and managed services for small and mid-market organizations. Nice. So, yeah. Okay, cool. And you're one of the founders. I am. I'm you're the sole founder. The I sole founder. Organization. That's yeah. awesome, man. Yeah. So t tell us a little bit about how large your team is and how you're kind of thinking about building your team out. Yeah. So right now we have four full-time people. We have an intern who we're converting to a part-time employee in January. Nice. We are hiring for another full-time person actively right now, interviewing multiple people. Probably grow to another two full-time people next year. Cool. And then we also have about six contractors that we rely on as well. So okay. Good deal. Small team. Good deal. Yeah. So yeah. you're building it. But like, how are you thinking about some of the challenges related to, tell us a little bit of some of the talent challenges that you've had this year and kind of how you're thinking about 2023 a little bit. Yeah. So, um... Yeah, there's a few different things when it comes to uh, talent challenges. Um, one is just finding people who know Salesforce, but then also understand, say, business analysis and project management, which is also kind of a hard combination. And then you have the development side. Yep. So for us, we're looking for people who have like one of those areas, and then we look to develop them because okay. we invest a lot in our team for development. Yep. I also provide direct mentorship with our team as well just because of my own career. And that's right. something we commit to is supporting each other as we grow. It's awesome. Yeah. Um, so in terms of like kind of mentorship also, like yeah. how do you think about mentoring some of your team members, even as you're growing a pretty small team, you still yeah. have to think about that, right? I think the thing that, you know, as a leader is, um, providing that time for people and making sure that it's their time. So making sure that we understand what their goals are for their professional life, their personal goals as well. And how do we align to that? How do we support that? 